Rin Schwarzer, welcome. I am Michael Irving of the Railway Military Police. Ranch campus though it may be, I will do my utmost to serve as chief instructor. <laughs> well, well, lucky me. Didn't expect to run into such a celeb at a place like this. Name's Randolph Orlando. Got transferred here from the Imperial Army Crossbell Unit. I've been hearing your name all over lately. Pleasure to finally meet the man himself. <laughs> Reen. I'm Reen Schwarzer. Just a rookie who recently graduated from Thor's main campus. Pleased to meet you, Major Irving. First Lieutenant Orlando. Likewise. It's an honor to be able to work with the famous Ashen Chevalier. But keep in mind, we're not looking for heroics from Divine Knights here. We're only interested in your aptitude as an instructor. Understood. He's from the Railway Military Police. I certainly didn't expect to find a ranking officer like him working here. Not to mention... That look tells me you know a bit about my sordid backstory. Been peeking through the Intelligence Division's files, I take it. Yes, I can't deny it. From what I could tell, it was a pretty complicated situation that sent you here. <laughs> Not as complicated as yours, I'm sure. Anyway, all of us instructors are here now. Major, Instructor Randolph, I'm looking forward to working with you. Indeed. I'm curious to see what you'll bring here. Especially after you turned down a position with us. I've been curious as to why. <laughs> uh, so you knew about that? Oh, that's so? You must be better than you look for the RMP to roll out the red carpet. I heard you graduated early. What are you, like 17 or something? Um... Actually, I'm 21. W what? Nah, -uh. you're seriously only three years younger than me? Four instructors. That's about what I was expecting, honestly. Are we going to teach the entire curriculum among us, though? Correct. There aren't many students, but it will still require great work on our part. Training, lectures, all manner of miscellaneous tasks. We will, however, receive assistance from the special advisor and the principal. We have a special advisor? And what's our principal like? Well... Let's just say that out of all the people in this great big empire, I never thought I'd meet someone quite as intense as our principal. Really? Uh, try not to be too shocked, okay? You've actually met her before, Reen. Thank you for waiting. Ah, speak of the devil. Coming. Hmm. Whatever is that slack-jawed expression for? I believe we met during the Civil War. Or have you already forgotten my face? Not that I give a whit either way. Uh, no, of course not. It's good to see you again, Professor Schmidt. I've always appreciated how you helped me with Valimar's Tachi. As I said before, save it. Though my title is Special Advisor, I plan to focus only on my research. 
Do endeavor to make yourself useful to me, Schwarzer. Or should I say, Ashen Awakener? <laughs> huh. He was one of Professor Epstein's disciples, right? Or maybe not. We sure he ain't some faker? Uh, no, he's the real deal. Uh, I'm starting to understand why I got hired here in the first place. I never imagined I would meet you here. Well, it's been about half a year, hasn't it, Schwarzer? Well, since we've all gathered, allow me to say a few words about myself. During the Civil War, I was the general of the defeated Noble Alliance. I then oversaw the Northern War, resulting in the annexation of North Ambria. But you may think of me as Aurelia Le Guin, principal of Thor's branch campus. <laughs> mean. All that packed into one woman. Guess it's not so crazy for you to be here after all, eh, Major? Uh, Principal Le Guin, it's time. Shall we proceed? Yes, let's begin. Herschel, gather up our fledglings and bring them to the grounds. Y yes ma'am! I'll see you soon, Rain. Bah! Alrighty, let's see what kind of guys and gals we got. Schwarzer, see to it you aren't late. Late? To what? To our entrance ceremony, of course. What? I had no idea. <laughs> that would be because we set the date and time without telling you. You'll even be meeting your fledglings there. Exciting, no? Show them what it means to be the Ashen Chevalier. It's starting to seem like the rumors about this place being... Difficult, or an exaggerations. All right then, I should probably put these on. Woman. Isn't she the Golden Rakshasa? And that black haired guy! Whoa! He's super famous! Huh, it's him! <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> oh dear. How unexpected. The Ashen Chevalier. No way. <laughs> what? Attention! I will have silence! We will now begin the entrance ceremony for Thor's Military Academy's branch campus. The opening speeches will be omitted. We will begin by announcing class assignments. First, Class 8, Combat Tactics. The instructor is Randolph Orlando. Right. Step forward when I call your name. Jessica, Wayne, Sydney, Maya, Ash, Freddy, Gustav, and Leonora. You eight. <laughs> Next, Class 9, Military Finance. The instructor is Toa Herschel. Um, I'll call out names now. Sandy, Kyrie, T. 
Tita, Luis, Tatiana, Valerie, Muse, Pablo, and Stark. There are nine of you in total. <laughs> Class 8 and Class 9. Combat tactics and military finance. Then the ones left over are... Silence! We will now have a word from our principal. Principal, if you would. Huh. I am Aurelia Le Guin, principal of the Branch Campus. As some of you are new to Erebonia, not all of you may be familiar with my name. That, however, is of little concern to me. A few of you may have noticed already, but I'll spell it out for the rest. This school is a trash bin. Huh? Hmm. Thor's main campus will be welcoming the Crown Prince this year. As such, it will go through heavy reform. This campus is a place they can toss aside those deemed too troublesome, or those with problematic backgrounds. Just like that, all of you, our instructors, and even myself, are here because we have been tossed aside. <sighs> hey now. No, Principal Le Guin, that is far too- However, there is a saying, be ever vigilant as though the world is a battlefield. Such a mindset is difficult to learn in times of peace. However, the situation we find ourselves in is a perfect environment for it. Those who lack the resolve to better themselves, to reforge themselves in the fires of adversity, leave now, or you run the risk of leaving later, in Adios' arms. Very well. In that case, I welcome each and every one of you to Thor's Military Academy's Branch Campus. Arise, O oh youth, and become the foundation of the world. I greet you with these familiar words from Emperor Dreykels. Well, I'm nice and overwhelmed now, but... Just where are we supposed to go? <sighs> General, um, Principal, could I get you to announce the final class? <sighs> huh? Very well. We'll be picking up after the main campuses, classes 1 through 6, with our own classes 7 through 9. The three of you make up Class 7, Special Operations. Your instructor will be him, Reen Schwarzer. the blueprints, but I didn't think it'd be this big. Don't get so excited. This facility is nothing remarkable. As I explained before, much of your duties will be performed here under my direction. I expect nothing short of raw talent from a Russell. Uh, yes, sir. So, she's a student here after all. I could swear I've heard the name Russell somewhere before. But more importantly,
that we're class seven is clearly no coincidence. Only three students, and she's one of them. Combat tactics and military finance are undergoing their orientations at the moment. Special operations will be having an orienteering exercise. You must make it through this facility in one piece. <laughs> in one piece? What does that mean? What is this building for? It's called Einhell Keep. It was built in conjunction with the branch campus for testing new methods of training. The interior is fully controllable via orbital technology and features variable difficulty levels. As for your exercise, you will be combating monsters and such unleashed within the keep. What? M monsters? That's a joke, right? Now I understand. Special operations, indeed. I guess this is a fitting enough exercise, given our class's name. And it's not just for my students, either, is it? It helps that you're quick on the uptake. That said, don't assume it will be the same as the Class 7 you were part of. Rather than an experimental clash between social classes, this one will act as an established task force for assignments in the field. And as its instructor, you will have your students see each assignment through. It's all starting to come together. H hold on just a second! We did what you said and came here, but what the heck is all this crap? This is just... <sighs> I mean, no one ever told me I was being put in some shady black ops squad. Your placement in Class 7 is the result of your aptitude test, Cadet Crawford. If you are dissatisfied, you have the option to pack your bags and return to the Military Police Academy. <laughs> That's all the way in Crossbell. I've yet to accept the situation, but I understand it now, at the very least. Can you give us more details? Certainly. Instructor Schwarzer and the three of you will enter the keep and stand by for further instructions. While on standby, they will explain their qualifications as you brief them on the use of the Arcus II. Understood. Bah! Finally, we can begin the trial. Disciple candidate, don't dawdle. Everything must be up and running in ten minutes. Yes. Damn, looks like this school's even more messed up than I'd heard. I'd prefer if non-affiliates stayed off the premises. <laughs> Take it easy. I ain't here to cause trouble. As soon as she's done with her orientation, I'm getting the hell out of here. Very well. You may have been referred here by the royal family, but don't forget your place. That extends to any actions you and your friends will take in the Empire from here on out. <laughs> I'd say that's up to you guys, you know? You got a whole country up to its neck in plots and schemes, and then a screwed up school like this pops up out of nowhere. Really makes you wonder who's pulling the strings around here. I suppose I should have expected as much from an A-rank bracer, 